Let's drag them all back again with another video, guys. And oh man, I've not posted in a minute. Uh, I apologize for this. Um, I've been really busy personal life stuff. Um, and because of that, because of that stuff, I have not been able to work on my business with selling stickers and stuff. Um, uh, especially selling, making merch that has been delayed massively because of my personal life issues I'm having, I had to deal with. Um, and, uh, YouTube channel has suffered a little bit because I haven't been able to post videos. But now I actually have some time to breathe and actually do that, those, those things. So I said, why not record a DBXM video for you guys? Because believe it or not, there has been new sneak peeks and stuff posted for this game that we're going to look at today. Not a whole lot, but it, 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 there's going to be some new sneak peeks that are posted today. We're going to look at, right? Now, before we start the video, I want you guys in the comment section down below, do you guys like DBXM? Are you guys excited? Right, because if you guys don't know, DBXM is currently closed. If you go to Roblox and try to play it, it will say J January 30th. That's when it's going to reopen, right? Um, it was supposed to open earlier, but it got delayed because basically he's going to be making it so we can customize our Super Saiyan hairstyles. And again, I don't know exactly how it's going to work. Um, I couldn't find the I, actual. I didn't feel like I tried to find the post he did it, but I don't remember which which one it's in. Either announced. I remember he did say it. Um, I, I don't feel like looking for it right now, but like, he did say that. Um, but we're gonna look at some of these other sneak peeks regarding a tournament. So, and, and this is one of the things I want to talk, talk about a little bit before we click on it. Because this is something that I think the game has needed for a while. The reason tournaments are, so, are such a great thing to have in a DB, DBZ game. Because other than grinding PL for forms... There's nothing to do, honestly. So having a tournament is just for fun. Like you could just go and just have fun, you know. It's kind of like the game modes they have, right? But it's a tournament. You can win rewards and like. So this is good. So uh, we have two things here. We have solo tournament mode, one of the best active to act activities to grind your power level. So we're gonna click on it. Now, again, this is a solo tournament um, mode. Now, I don't know how it's going to work. Like, will all your opponents be NPCs, right? If they will, like, you know, like, do you choose what NPC you get to fight? Or, like, you know, those things, right? Because you can see it's a tournament. Right? You get the, the brackets, and then you have, you know, the final battle. Um, it, I, I'm excited, right? And we're going to look at another picture because he puts another picture of this, which I believe this is this is right here. And we can see, uh, we have first round, second round, and final round. And right here, you'll see a black box that actually shows rewards from first, second, and final round, right? And you can see, you get power level. Now, again, if you make it to, like, for example, if you lose in the second round, you get 5,392 power PL, right? And let's say you constantly enter the tournament. Let's say you consistently lose the second round, right? You're, you're getting like 10k power level from two, losing two rounds of, of the second round, right? Like if you make it to the final round, if you win if you win a tournament multiple times, the final round, you're getting 10, 10k PL. So that's like 20, uh, that's a lot. That's like 21k PL total, right? Really, think about it, right? So, right? So this, 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 this is actually really good and I'm definitely going to use this because... This is awesome. And what and one of the things also I love about this is this right here. So you'll see a, a spectate. Now I'm assuming this is like if either you lost or your match hasn't come up, like you lost, you want to spectate the fight, you can. Um, but this is awesome. I love this. I, I I'm I'm really excited about this because I love tournaments and, and dra deep, um, Dragon Ball games. Um so this this is great for me. I'm really excited about this. I want you guys to put in the comment section right now if you guys are excited for this as well. Let me know down below. I want to know. I want to know. Your boy wants to know. Um, that that's just him being you know funny, whatever. Um. So, like I said, one of the things he is one of the things we're gonna be getting in this update, and you know, when the game reopens and all that, is he wants to work on. He said he's working on. Um, basically improving customization, right? Such as, you know, um, 
you know, such as, you know, hairs. So we, again, we will be getting new hairstyles. Um, also new face styles. We see one of the new face styles, and I like this. I like this. Is this that like you know reminds me of that like like the Bardock like saying where like they're constantly in battle. They have battle scars. It'll be nice. Uh, this would be really great. This, I, I, I'm really excited about this. Um, personally, I, I think this. I'm really excited about this uh, because one of the thing when it, when it comes to dragon um, a dragon Ball game in general, one of the things that 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 is a make or break for me is customization. I am really big on customization. That is what makes it a bracelet for me. All right. You know what I mean? Like you want to customize your character, make it look like you what you you know what I mean? As if your character was in the actual Dragon Ball anime fighting alongside Goku. Like you know what I mean? So I love this. I like this. In fact, I want you guys to put down in the comment section down below how many of you are gonna use a face like this when it when the game reopens. How many are you gonna try to f use a face like this? Let me know in the comment section down below. I want to see it. I want to see them comments. I want to see the comments. Do it, okay? <laughs> um. We want to go to small analysis because. All right, so. Hold up. All right, so these are small announcements. This stuff was posted like like twelve twenty, like back basically last year twenty twenty two. Um, a little old, but we're gonna look at them anyway because I think this is important. Um, then we we'll go to the uh. The uh, the other thing you guys gonna want to hear about hybrid science, you guys want to hear. It says here for the human for for the human like races, they will have over fifty to one hundred eye selections. That is crazy. That is crazy. After the eye selection, I'm going to add more animation selections. After the character uh, creation, I'm going to work on the tutorial mode and and then finish the story mode. This is what I'm happy about. This game needs more customization and the, and the story mode. I've been waiting for the stream forever because again, if you guys know me, if there's one thing that makes my day is a awesome game with a good story. I love, like I'm per like one of the things I want to do one day is write stories, bro. Like it, 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 write a good story is very important to me. So I, I love that they have that. Um, updated pause menu for all platforms you, you see here. Boom, right? Um, we can see some cool. We see now. Here's the cool thing we see. If you guys go to the bottom, we see fusion. That's right, fusion. Now I'm very interested. Now again, I'm very interested to see how fusion is gonna work. Like now again, if any of you guys actually do know, like how fusion is gonna work in terms of in terms of like when you fuse, can you choose to fuse with the NPC or a actual player? If any of you watching this video know the answer to that question, please answer me in the comments down below because I seriously have no clue if it's going to be both or just player only or NPC only or both. I don't know. I really want to know this because, again, if you think with the NPC is actually more reliable than fusing with the player, you got to find it, you know. So, please, let me, if you guys, if, if one of you watching this video knows the answer to this question, please, I'm begging you, give me the answer because I really want to know because I, 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 I don't know. I really don't. Um, next we have, for those who use, who use Gogeta Stance, we'll see a revamp. So, Gogeta Stance, is that? Gogeta Stance. Uh. I, I, wait, is this for like just... Oh, I, I actually look. Hold up. I like when he puts his hand on his waist like I'm the man. That's right. I whoop your butt. Yo. Okay. Okay. I like this. I like that. All right. Uh, next thing I want to go over is this. So, so if you guys don't know, um, Super Saiyan 3, before he closed the game, was kind of useless because he had, he had not added the mastery because, again, he did... I did ask this question in the chat in the one of the streams he was doing on this on the server, and he did say they did. I did make a question and answer not by him but other people as well. That yes, Super Super Saiyan three 
when you master Super Saiyan 3, it won't drain anymore. Basically like Timmy G does, it won't drain anymore because you mastered it. You learn how to use the form perfectly, right? You mastered it. So it's not going to drain. So that's something I'm really off about. He says here, UI mastery will be fixed or something like that, which again, you see this? Ooh, look at this. All right. The next thing is the thing I want to go to you guys, talk to you guys about, which is the whole hybrid Saiyan thing. All right. So before we get to that, the hybrid Saiyan, I want to talk about this because he says here. I'm officially removing training mode. Why? Because I want to. You're probably going to ask, then how would we train? Here is the answer. You can grind your power level through game mode, mentor training, quick mentor sparring, the time chamber, story mode, and parallel quest. Um, so, basically, god chamber, normal chamber, Fighting your mentors, actually sparring with them, gives you power level. And the very last thing of this video we're going to talk about, the very last thing, probably one of the all really cool things about this. Hybrid Saiyans are being added back. And, and, and it's going to have the basic Gohan genetics, right? Now, he says that means Super Saiyan 1, 2, 3, and Mystic slash Ultimate, the Ultimate form, same thing. Um... But here, here's it. Here's here, here. Now, here's what I like about this, right? So basically, what this what this is gonna do is, the higher your mastery is, the stronger your form is, right? So I'm guessing that when you first get this form, it's gonna be probably a Super Saiyan two, maybe even a Super Saiyan three level, right? At max, right? And here's where mastery comes into play. So it says here, it says here, thirty percent mastery equals. Su um, Super Saiyan God equivalent, which means that your ultimate form, aka Mystic, will be equal to a super the power of a Super Saiyan God, right? And if you if you get to seventy percent mastery, your form gets a power buff, and now your your Mystic form, or I'm gonna say Ultimate form for now. I don't care. I'm saying Ultimate now. Your Ultimate form will be on par. So the multiplier will be on par now with Super Saiyan Blue and Limit Breaker Super Saiyan 4, right? And then when you fully master your ultimate form, fully master it, 100% mastery, this will make your ultimate form stronger than Super Saiyan Blue and Limit Breaker Super Saiyan 4 and on par with Super Saiyan Blue Evolution. So I like this, how this form gets stronger the more you master it. This makes a lot of sense, right? So I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Um, I do have a merch announcement. I'm gonna be going. I'm gonna be talking about soon. Um, again, like I said, merch has been delayed because I've been doing some personal life stuff. So everything in my life outside of what I've been dealing with has been delayed. So just making YouTube videos, all that. So trust me, merch is coming. It really is. Like I'm working hard on it. Trust me. It's gonna. Trust me when I say this. It's gonna happen. Trust me. Trust me, all right. Also, before we go, before you guys, before I let you guys go, one last thing I want you guys to do for me. Join my Discord server. Our Discord server. Um. Join, bro. We have fun just hanging out. Join. It's it's cool. Cool. You can see a lot of people on the server. Join, my friend. Become part of the Keyless Dragon Ball family. Become part of it. Love to see you guys here again. You guys want to go to our server? We have grinding. So if you guys play when the game open, when the game reopens, you need someone to grind with to help you out. Come here to this server. And I'm telling you right now, you'll find someone to help grind with you. All right. You got news for DBXM, right? Um, if you want to check your power level and see how strong everybody else is to help gauge your strength. Again, here, you can gain your power again. Before the game closed, I got to 4 million. Um, actually, 4.2, actually, mil. Um, again, you got your art channel. 
You get nice art. In fact, um, you got. Look at that. That's pretty. That's pretty good. You got this, bro. All right. We have question. We have question of the day, which I'm gonna start doing. Answers. We even have a meme. We even have a meme channel, bro. Where you guys can upload memes. It's funny, like, bro. All right. And we have YouTube news. When I post a video, this is where it's gonna. It's gonna go. Um, announcements, rules again. General chat. It, it's gonna be cool. Make sure you guys join my Discord server. I will post a link. And yeah. Peace. I'm done with bullshit. At this point, I'm merely.